Hello guys, I have a big problem with my Core PA2X Pro. I'm going to show you the steps I follow to do a factory reset. First of all, I format the internal memory of the device. Please follow me. I press the intro 1 button and then I hit the power button. And I wait until I see the menu. Now, I will choose from my hard disk the format and then I select. Are you sure? Yes. So, the first step is done, and now I have to switch off and do the same thing. So I switch off, I keep my button pressed, and switch on again. I keep my finger pressed on intro 1. So, now I select from the menu here, if it lets me, takes a while, use the um, hard disk, select the format, and I use the PA2X operating system and resources version 202 uh, dot package. And then I select. Are you sure? Yes. At this point, I will switch off the video and I'll switch it on again after this step is done. So, as you can see, uh, I have to switch off and switch it on again or I can just press OK. So I press OK and we will wait to see the menu. As you can see, it's operating version 202, which is the latest uh, released version from the official Core website. In the meantime, I have to switch on my uh, audio system so that we can hear the sound. So now uh, we have to calibrate the display because it's now the first time we are using it after this factory reset and we can save it. Now please watch what happens with these three LEDs. The first one here, it never turn, turns on again but the other ones are doing so. So only this one does not turn on. And the other one is here uh, with, uh, with the, uh, this LED underneath because as you can see it is not lit. The other one is here, the single touch. It never turned on again. But the buttons themselves are okay because um, when I, whenever I press, for example, this button, play style, style play, uh, it works. When I press the other one, as you can see, it goes to the song play mode or sequencer mode. 
or sound mode and style mode style play mode again but the LED is not working and the same thing applies to here when I press this um, you can see uh, it will change from favorite to bank 1 to 10 or uh, bank 11 to 20 and so on uh, this is the first problem with my keyboard so the main problem is that when I start any standard style it won't play although the display shows it's playing for example like this I select the bank for example from here uh, this one for example bank this uh, standard 8-bit for example and now hit the start button like you see it shows it's running even here it shows it's running but we can't hear any sound it's like so but uh, every sound uh, above the split point is okay for example if I hit this button you can see the you can hear the the, uh, the audio file the audio the sound but not from here even if I do play any 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 of these chords and it's interesting that the the different chords are recognized here now I play different ones different ones like here uh, just you see it is recognized but there is no sound um, and when I when I just press the split point button I turn it off and now I can hear every sound sound from everywhere even from the lower part so now I check the global settings I press the global I select the audio setup and here I make sure every single track is routed to the same output as the other ones so basically if I can hear my right hand uh, keys when I play, uh, play them so I basically should be able to hear the uh, uh, left hand when, when the split point is off but I, but I uh, don't hear any, anything from the uh, drum kits or percussions or bass or any automatic accompaniment but like you can see here everything uh, is routed to the left and right output actually everything about my keyboard was okay until uh, I did the factory reset yesterday so I found these problems with the LEDs and these uh, audio problems now even even the, in the song playing mode if I load some mp3 files uh, the device is not able to play them in the uh, player 1 uh, nor in player 2 uh, I don't know what has what, uh, what has happened to this device after factory, the first factory reset I did but I feel like the device is completely lost and it seems like uh, I have a hardware problem I don't know where exactly if it is a problem in the main board or uh, in the audio amplifier board or uh, but but uh, uh, I've I've used the test mode of the device using uh, uh, play style and media uh, these two buttons when I press keep them pressed and then I turn on the device I can bring the device into the uh, test mode and when I run the test um, the, the result was that uh, these LEDs are these three LEDs that I showed you these are permanently turned off and I could not uh, uh, turn them on uh, but any other um, um, uh, test steps like testing the PCM RAM and the hard disk uh, or all the buttons and keys everything was fine 
uh, I don't know uh, if if you have any idea or opinion about all of these problems, I would appreciate if, if you share it with me. Thank you.